Hello everyone, welcome back, here is Van Amsen, and today we have a very interesting uh, challenge to solve uh, in C++, number of longest increasing subsequence. So, uh, we are given a function and uh, array of integer with nums, and we need to return uh, the number of longest increasing subsequences. So, let's look at uh, some uh, example. So, for example, we have uh, 1, 3, uh, five, four, uh, seven, array, and we need to return number of longest subsequence. So first we need to find longest uh, increasing subsequence. So for example, going from one to three, three to five, five to seven. So all numbers are increasing. So the length of this uh, sequence is four. And uh, second sequence, so for example, going from one, three, three, four, because four is greater than three, and four to seven is also four. So we have uh, two sequence, we can see that we cannot find any uh, other sequence, so we need to return two, because uh, it's a uh, uh, sum of uh, our uh, longest uh, sequences. So yeah, also we have a second example with just two, so if we have two uh, and nothing more, so two is pointing to the two itself, so longest increasing subsequence is length only one and total number of this uh, sequence of length one is five. So output should be five for a test case uh, example two. So let's uh, try to implement it. We can implement it using uh, dynamic programming. So first thing first, so int n will be num size result zero and max len will be zero as well so vector int len n zero count and zero and for i less than n increment and len will be count i and count one and for j J less than i, if num at position i is greater than j, so if len of i greater than len of j plus 1, we update it. So count will be count plus 1, and if len of i is less than len j plus 1, we know that len will be len j plus one because we found longer length and count will be count uh, of count j and yes and finally if max len uh, will be equals to the len of i result will be count plus one and max length will be len at position of i and result will be count i and finally we return our sort value so result okay so uh, let's try to run it uh, and i will explain what we did so yeah it's working for a given test case awesome so uh, first we uh, in our approach uh, is to use a dynamic programming as mentioned before and we store the length and count of the longest subsequence for each index so we declare two vector of size n and uh, length and count and fill them with ones so we also need a variable max length uh, to track the longest length and answer to store the final uh, result so uh, we iterate through our num vector for each number we update the length and count of the longest subsequence ending at particular index. And with two nested loops, we check if pairs of numbers. So if num i is greater than num j, so it means we have found an increasing uh, subsequence uh, because yeah, j is greater than i. And uh, in this case, if uh, length of j is greater or equal to length of i, we update length and count uh, if length 
uh, plus one equals length i. And we add count j to count i. So after processing each element, we check if we have a new maximum uh, length. Uh, if so, we update max length uh, and our answer. And finally, our function will return the answer, which will represent the number of longest increasing subsequence in our input vector num. So let's run it for unsynthesis cases as well. So hopefully it will pass. Uh, yeah, so we have successfully completed this task and our implementation beat 84% with respect to runtime and 66 with respect to memory. So all good. And there we have it, a complete walkthrough on how to solve the number of longest increasing subsequence problem in C++ uh, using dynamic programming. So I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have any question or insights, uh, please drop a comment below and make sure to like, share and subscribe to uh, stay updated with our coding adventures. And remember, keep practicing, keep coding and see you next time.